What is going on YouTube? Just helping you out here. And for today I will be doing chapter 4, problem 3 in the Fundamentals of Physics textbook by Gerald Walker, Halliday and Resnick, the 8th edition. And chapter 4 is all about 3-dimensional and 2-dimensional motion or kinematics. So for problem 3 we are given an electron and we are given the vector, the unit vector. So, you know, it has like the i hat, j hat, and k hat. And for part A, we are asked to find its magnitude. And whenever it just, whenever you're trying to find the magnitude of a vector, you are trying to find like its distance. So we're going to use the distance formula and say vector equals square root of the x component squared plus the y component squared plus the z component squared. And in this case, that will be 5 squared plus negative 3 squared plus 2 squared. One thing you just need to make sure is if you have a negative component, like a negative 3 here, you have to square the whole thing so that negative 3 becomes positive 9. You've got to just make sure the parentheses are on the outside of the negative, not on the, on the, yeah, outside of the negative, not like on the inside of it. So you make sure you keep your signs straight. And then when you do that, you should get 6.2 meters for the magnitude. And then part B asks us to sketch the vector. And so what we're going to do... Now, this is going to be a little tough since it's three-dimensional and it's kind of hard to draw, but I will do my best. So we have our y-axis, that's a very bad line, but whatever. And we have our x-axis, and then our z will go like that. So try to picture this in three dimensions. So this is our z-axis, our y, and our x. And it says that the vector is five units in the x, so we'll say that's five. Negative three in the y, We'll say that's negative 3, and 2 in the z, so we'll say about there is 2. So our three-dimensional vector will go something like that. So that way it's, see here, 5 units in the x, 3 units in the y, and then in our z, that should probably come out more over here, but you get the idea. So if you found this video helpful, Please drop a like, leave a comment if you have an idea for a future video or a question about something I did. And lastly, please don't forget to subscribe and tell your friends about me. That way I can grow and help more of you guys out. Since we're coming into the summer months now, most people will not need help with uh, schoolwork. So I will most likely be posting more more um, reviews and unboxings or something or videos like that that you guys would like to see or more tutorial videos on non school work unless some of you have summer work that is due next for next year and you're struggling with it don't hesitate to send me um, a, or leave a comment for that or send me a message on Instagram my Instagram is in the description below so I'm just helping you out see you in the next video